community, we too are working on continuing the dialogue on race and how it affects each of us. The NBC6 team is sharing their own experiences with race through courageous conversations. Tonight we're hearing from Markel Sinet. At an early age, I always had an understanding of race because my parents wanted me to be well educated. So in elementary school, I was probably watching movies that most people probably wouldn't watch or images that most people wouldn't see until after they graduated from high school or college. But they always wanted me just to have an understanding of what people of African ancestry went through so they could make sure that I appreciated whatever opportunities had been afforded to me. There was a stereotype in my hometown. If you went to a certain school that was in what was historically the black neighborhood, you were going to receive an inferior education. So I made sure I went to college. I graduated in three years because I wanted to show everyone just because you come from a certain neighborhood, a certain t side of town, you can still be just as successful. Growing up, I know when I went to a popular department store in my hometown, my mother, along with the rest of my family, we would be followed. So those are experiences other people might not ever understand, and I don't want anyone to discredit our stories. And I'm willing to have an open dialogue with anyone because I understand if you didn't go through what I went through, some of the images that you see on the news or on television, you might not understand. I think it's great that we're at a point in our country where people are willing to listen because I feel like for the longest, people didn't think that there was still an issue. So that makes me happy that people are just willing to listen and talk and just know that your experiences will not be the same as someone else's. Change isn't going to happen overnight. All we can do is hope that the generation, the kids now, we can properly educate them so they can do better than those before us further each generation and we're sharing our stories and working to promote understanding all week long on NBC 6 News at 10. Tomorrow night NBC 6 News director John Walton will share his courageous conversation.